Some hard nose on this one. Why? What are you so ant? What? Jeez, it's a very clean. Guys! Hello and good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Looks like we might have a little something, something going on today. Yeah. Not just today, every day. <laughs> this has been kind of what I've been doing with my mornings the past couple of days. I am trying to go through every single kid's room, and get rid of stuff that doesn't fit them, stuff that they don't need, stuff that they don't use, stuff that we will never use again. Get rid of those things and then also thin out our house. If you didn't know, we're moving. We are? <laughs> We've got moving boxes in the hallway. Like, I don't know, something about coming up the stairs and seeing moving boxes, it hits me. This is real. We are actually doing this the house that we're building that we go and visit every day is where we will eventually live, which means we will be moving out of this house. I don't know, something about it almost just seems like it's not it's really- feeling real. a little bit more real. This is now go time, it's real time. It's go time. So I went through the little boy's room the other day. Just in case you're curious, I have one entire box just of Rex and Squishmallows. Yeah. <laughs> so. This is the combination of a few days. I just wanted to give mom a mad shout out because she starts every morning some kind of an exercise or on a something. The kid's up and going and doing their thing and then immediately dives into getting prepped and ready to move, sell the house, show the house, yeah. all those different things. So this has been a labor of love every morning, something that she's been terrified of doing, or I guess it's, it's been, been like daunting. It's really hard to start, and I don't know if it's because it's like- It's overwhelming. It's like There's admitting so that we're finally much. moving, but also we have a lot of rooms to go through. So I'm almost through my second room. That's what we said, just one room at a time. Yep. Don't focus on the entirety of the home. Today is Rex and Crew's room. Tomorrow is Rag room. So today, let's go check out Rag room with all the problems yeah, you, guys you guys made in there. come on in. Let me just step over these six bags of clothes that he no longer fits in, and then I'll head down here. You look at the actual closet and what he has that fits him. There's nothing in there that fits him. I didn't even show. I should have done like a before. There's gotta be some footage somewhere. This was covered in boxes of technology. So one thing to know about Ryler, he loves to keep every box from everything that he buys. I love so it too. So basically his got, room is full of cars. I got GoPro boxes, iPhone boxes. I got all kinds of drone boxes from the first drone I ever had. I get that way too. But then over time you realize, man, I'm just collecting cardboard, so. Yeah, I know, and his closet, you Chock couldn't full. even see anything in it. He has like- He also like, collects backpacks apparently. He's a collector of backpacks. Yeah. He's got a backpack from every year of his life. We've saved <laughs> now, we have three. And that's not including a school backpack. Then you did see six bags worth of clothes. So there was a lot of clothes in there. They just weren't clothes that fit. Tons of clothes up there. None of them fit. Today, doing some rearranging. We're thinking of rearranging the furniture to make the room a little bit bigger, a little more spacious. That's what he wants Thin to it out a few things. Check out this closet though, you guys. I mean, this thing was so chock full, you couldn't even walk in it. And now you've got basically a couple of shirts hanging up on the side so there. So he has, these are Church basically clothes sweatpants and done. that fit him. Three long sleeve shirts that fit him. A couple pairs of pajamas, Disney shirts. Then he has a couple of other shirts here. We've got quite the collection here. He's got his 3D printer stuff. That's it. Closet That's it. thin. Done. Oh, and the backpacks. Do you get the backpacks? Oh, the backpacks. Oh. Are they? Those are the ones we're keeping? Yeah, All right, we're really keeping those. Crazy. Okay, next up, room reorganization. Maybe thinking of switching so, the bed back this direction, or what are your yeah, thoughts there, bro? So, I have two things that I maybe want to try. First one is just getting the bed, shoving it that way. Okay. But I feel like that would make it look Might like look a little weird. I've always wanted one that's like up against the wall, because when I was little, I had one, and I just like staring at the wall. It's weird. <laughs> really wow. weird. But I want to. I put you in timeout. <laughs> You could always just lay on the floor. Have I do think the original, way. the original way, surfboard above it, I think that makes it shows feel really well. So big. Yeah, yeah. I think you when people come to sad? see the house, it shows really well. Next room is not a surf theme. So Ooh, though. but the next room is so sick. Mom has got every room dialed so like you wouldn't believe. Good. You can give me the credit. That's nice of you. It's but Nicole. It's obviously. Elmo themed, guys. Sorry, I just have to tell you. <laughs> not any Elmo. Tickle me, Elmo. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> so creepy. <laughs> I can leave where I was going. I oh, really quick, see. show us uh, the progress on Brex and Crew's room as yes, well. Yes, in fact, as I've gone through things, I'm like, okay, well, this will fit them then, this will fit them then. So there's a few things I'm going through that I am moving Guys, down. we're legit moving. We're packing into boxes, thinning out the home, getting rid of stuff that we're not going to take with us. This room is the last oh. room we will do. Yeah, Sorry. we're not doing that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I just showed it. That's I showed it. That's probably why I Sorry. haven't started. I showed it. Look at this. They've made a giant mess, and it's not even that big. It's just a couple of shirts, because yeah. there's nothing you can really mess up. It's made, sort of. We did somehow decide to leave the giant avocado squishmallow dresser completely cleared off. There was so much stuff on these. Totally cleared off. Cleared and cleaned. And then I'm going to open the closet. Just fingers crossed. It looks good. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this. It is like empty. There is nothing up there. Nothing there. We can organize the hangers, kind of pinch things together. Some hats hung, but this is empty. Pretty much. I mean, bare bones. Ice is just the things but it's, you're going to And oh, I forgot the biggest part of this entire project. Under the beds. Mom oh spent my. almost the entire morning cleaning it under the beds. It was insane. Thin them out and ice is anything that you're going to need between now and Thanksgiving. Let's keep. This has been your life, your mornings, every day. And then we get up until about the point where the vlog gets posted, we get back into whatever we're gonna do for the rest of today. I know you got some things you gotta do. We can help Ryan move his furniture around. I and I think wait. we have some exciting plans for this afternoon. Just remember to vacuum underneath every area before you move something onto it, okay? All right. And then you guys, we need backpacks. They're gonna do that. Wait, we then... do? I just saw a closet full of backpacks. That's actually really funny. Those are not school <laughs> backpacks. We need oh. more backpacks yeah, to add to his backpack collecting habit. Yeah, so we, we do, need though. to go buy backpacks for school. School and backpacks let's... today? Yes. Okay, let's do, let's do it.
great progress here. Opened up this entire area, putting some nightstands up here, kind of back to its original format, which I think makes this look a lot bigger. Right now, temporary setup is desk over here. I do think it works. We'll see, he's gonna organize it, declutter. But something that I was just thinking as we're moving this stuff that is crazy strange is none of this is coming with us. This is all staying, so we're either going to sell, donate, or even offer up the house as fully furnished. Somebody wants that yeah. because then we don't have to move this stuff or sell it, which is nice too. None of this is coming. This is mom's bed set from when she was like in high school or junior high. It's been in the family that long. Oh, I love it. <laughs> he doesn't love it. Nightstand, that's a full set, and it was a big deal when she got it, you guys. This was our set when we first got married. It was our actual bedroom set for our bedroom all the way until we moved here and gave it to Rye, guys. This has been around a while. It's just weird as we move these things around, making things look as good as they can. I was thinking, man, this is gonna be a beast to take this, be a beast to take this, but none of us coming. He's got a whole new... this is good right here? <laughs> He got a whole new bed set up, everything new in his room. So all the furniture stays, which is nice. We're just moving things around, not moving yeah. them with us. Dude, great progress here. Let's you do the rest of the decluttering. Got the heavy stuff. Feels good though, doesn't it? Oh yeah. Rye Guy is making some serious progress and headway on his room. I'm actually gonna run middle boys off to tumbling, as you guys know, flipping, back flipping, tumbling and full sending was a big part of Crew's birthday. He's excited and stoked. He and Brex both to go back to their tumbling class, work on their flips and tricks. I'm gonna run a couple of birthday errands. We do have a couple of birthdays in the house yet to come. We've got moms coming up in literally two days, and then we have Rye Guys two weeks after that. So I'm gonna run a couple birthday errands after I drop them off at tumbling, and we will get back together, reconvene, head off to do some backpack shopping. I think I also heard lunch boxes, maybe some socks. I don't know if we're gonna get to shoes. No shoes is on the agenda and school uniforms. I don't know that we're gonna get to that today either, but all those things are going to be happening at some point. We wind down, I don't wanna say wind down. No, it's sad, it's sad. No, as we wind up, as we gear up for the last three weeks of summer. <laughs> We got the kids. Tumbling, how was it? Good. Awesome. Pretty good. You guys look like sweaty bosses back sweaty. there. They came out working up quite the workout. Work up a workout. Weird phrase, Dad. But we are going back to school, which is something I should probably do so I can learn how to speak. We're going to be getting some backpacks today. In our initial school supply haul that we did, Rock Guy chose a backpack and Hazy snagged a backpack. But we want to see what else there is out there. Kind of felt like they grabbed them pretty quickly. And the other two boys don't have them. And we also need to pick up some lunch boxes. Because we're going to be doing some school lunches mm -hmm. this year again. So I already got a lunch box out. Oh, you did? Okay. Oh, so all of that's going down right now. We're gonna go into the store, pick out some backpacks, maybe get some like socks or something like that. I don't know, just Ooh. little odds and ends. Who's excited for back to school? <laughs> school edition and travel edition, I love it. Oh, it is yeah. busting <laughs> shoes. AZ, I found a backpack for you. It's the perfect size. Yeah, it is. You like that? Wait, but there's no straps. I think it's a lunchbox. I know. <laughs> lunchbox that matches your backpack. How cool would that this be? This is the kind like Hazy got for hers. I just found her this one. Pretended that it was her backpack, but it's these are lunchboxes, right? Backpack shape. So how cool is that? So much good food. I'm getting some hard nose on this one. Why? What are you so ant? What? Jeez, it's a very clean. Guys, it's cool. It's like graffiti <laughs> shark kidding. mouth. No, it's just a little. Cool. It's a little younger than him. I like thought I would get it for me. Up. So we found this one that online that he wants. They have it on in-store pickup. Wait, who? This is Brex and Rye Guy. This is Brex. Oh. Rye Guy, are you finding one that you like better than the one you already chose? Nope. Let's that go is one find thing that someone. we're doing here today. They have one here that Rye Guy likes better than the one that he already he just chose. Plain black. With a brown bottom, which is cool. It's classic. Two tone. There are so many. I mean, look at you. You are in a sea of backpacks. Target the other day. They only had a few backpacks. They had like one I'm row, really handful. Surprised. And they're on sale. And they're on sale. And I think there's only one section. Mom said the boys they section might have, might have more. Department. Head over there, see what else they have. But tons and tons of choices today. So Brex and crew on the hunt. I think crew found his the second we walked in the door. He's like done. So like, well, that was uneventful. Tons of. And he has a lunchbox. Like, at, at least use. fake put on a couple others to make it seem like it was a tough decision. But he walked in and he put it on and he's like, this is the this one. This is so the one. That's nice. When crew can make a decision that fast on something, you, guys, he's the hardest you go with one. it. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't a one and done, maybe not a slam dunk, because now that he's looked at it in the mirror, it's kind of like a mini backpack. Like it only goes, it sits really high though. If you loosened it and it had some weight in it to pull it down, he's looking at himself in the mirror and he's like, no, that's like weird. It's like a tiny backpack. Maybe that's not the one, dude. You know? I don't think so. I do love the design, the logo, mm -hmm. the Nike everywhere. But if you're not gonna be feeling it, that's your backpack all year. You wanna get one you love. Yeah. <laughs> the joke, the joke. Although you can see other people have done that and it's not funny. Rexy, we got it for you, bro. Three, two, one. Yes? No? no. 
Oh, I don't know. I tried. Boom. I know the other one you said was a little kiddish, but this one. We already have one, one like that. That's no. in Ryler's actual backpack collection. In his collection. actual collection in his closet. Yeah, he's already got that one. Guys, <laughs> okay. it comes with a little canteen one? pouch, too. Look at that thing. Five piece set. You know what? I'll take you know the ice pack. Here's just a little piece of advice to all you moms. The circle lunch boxes are super annoying to pack because, like, the lid does not stay Sandwiches open. Sandwiches are square, by the way, guys. <laughs> Circle and square. <laughs> oh, my gosh, what? you guys. Those I need the awesome. you need. Just one. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Thank you so much. They went and found this one in the back. This is the one Brexy wanted. None of them were out here on display. And I was getting kind of bummed because I was so excited about the listing when I saw it. Even back kind of smaller. That's perfect for Brexy. Maybe that's a new thing, though, because kids mostly have, like, tablets and other digital Mom, stuff. Maybe it's down? less. Oh, you know why? The other ones are made for trapper keepers. Oh, These ones are not for trapper right. keepers. That's why. <laughs> got this one. Love it. Let me see this. Okay, love it. We got some. Oh, I like that. And then you walked by and this caught your eye a little bit. Try that one So on. he confided in me over by the mirror. He's like, I like it. So like when she brought it well, out. Well, it's totally different when you see things It's just not exactly what I was thinking. But now he sees this one. He's loving it. We want him to love it, you guys. This is their backpack the entire year. It's an extension of their outfit every single day. It's a little personality piece because as you guys know, these guys wear uniforms to school and the so they can't actually really put a lot of personality into their outfit selection. So their backpack can be the one thing that is a little bit of personality. We were able to accomplish a few things there. We ended up with one backpack, a couple of shirts. Yep. Anyways, pretty big bags worth. Here's the best part. Spent 12 bucks. I know, because I had dollars. a gift card to Kohl's. Yeah. And I was like, why not use it? use it? So that's great. We were able to knock out a few things. Didn't cost us much, but because we weren't able to get all the backpacks, we're going on to store number two right now. Yeah. Crew was able to snag a backpack, sell all that. Now we're moving on to lunch boxes. I don't think anybody has a great lunch box yet, do they? Did Brexit didn't get that Hazy one? Got one. Hazy got one. Did you get that one at the last store? Mm -hmm. Okay, gotta get you one too. That's a wrap on the backpack situation. We did not find lunch boxes for everyone. We have two lunch boxes, I believe. Crew's gonna use an old one, and Hazel has one. Is that right? Raw guy needs a lunch box. Rex needs a lunch box. We've run out of time. We've checked every place here. I don't think lunch boxes is like a hot thing to keep on shelves. They did have a ton of variety in backpacks. Well, Amazon has plenty of lunch boxes. Absolutely. So, so they want to find something that also complements backpacks that they chose. We'll go home, show you all the backpacks that they got, and then they're gonna probably find lunch boxes to go with it. Being here reminded me we've got to do shoes, we need socks, a bunch of other stuff. So I think we're gonna be doing a repeat heat trip coming back here. Smash yeah. the like, you guys, if you'd like to see us come back and get some shoes. I know the kids do have a lot of shoes, but during the school year specifically, they need some athletic, well, they need shoes. athletic shoes. And then they also need uh, like a pair of shoes that maybe you don't care as much about getting trashed because yeah. you, know, you play hard at recess. <laughs> Got everybody home now. They are all backpacked out. I do think we have backpacks for everyone. Backpacks are solid. But just to be sure, we're gonna do a little fashion show for you. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the Bingham Backpack Collection of 2022-2023. Bring them on out, everybody. Woo! Oh, oh, here we have Hazel with the green and cherry backpack. Looking good. Rexy Doodle, a little bit of a tie-dye twist with a nice Look turquoise. That's a really good color, that's dude. That's a looking. great color. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Somebody's got Look that Nike. This. Fire! Oh, Lit it. Sauce 9000 and Raga coming in clutch with the classic. Wait a minute. Short one too. Are you jacking that up really high yeah, in your back? he's got it jacked up. Love it though. He's got that classic black, the brown bottom. He did say today, he might go back and get the brown one we saw at the store. He really liked it. So we don't know, he might go yeah, get it. I like that one. Love that one. I will go back and get it. Yeah. <laughs> so that might not be his backpack. So that's part of the collection uh, for 2020. It's an issue. There's a lot of things to buy, a lot of moving parts. And these guys want to <laughs> nail it just <laughs> right because this is their backpack for the next year. And then, of course, Rai Guy's it. also collecting yeah. these. So this is something he's got to add to his collector addition at the top of his closet so it's a big deal guys line them up what we got what we working Yay! with oh there they are you guys it. the bingham backpacks i love it but yeah like we said earlier this is their little piece of personality they can take with them because they do have school uniforms it. something yeah. else we're going to be showing you guys and pretty they kind of like lighten the shoe part of the school uniform kids get to show their personality through their shoes as well you say lighten you mean like loosen the it used to be like strictly black or got strictly it. navy brown shoes yet to get and school uniforms new socks stay tuned those are gonna be all coming up back to yeah. school nearly wrapped up again still a few things I have to say this every time just so that you guys don't start thinking that we're thinking about school because I'm not thinking about school. Oh, no, no, Lots no. of summer 
are yet to be had. We have a birthday coming up in the house. We got another birthday coming up in the house. We got Finally. water parks, amusement parks, so we many do. fun summer things Woo! to still do. As well as, of course, <laughs> massive updates on the home in progress there because it's summer, baby, and all the good stuff happens in summer. It does, you guys. We love you so much. Thank you for hanging with us. We'll see you all tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye. Some hard nose on this one. Why? What are you so anti? What? Jeez, it's a big one. Guys! Good joke. Good joke. Although you can see other people have done that and it's not funny. How about one of these with a cool maple leaf on it? You guys want to get one of those? No, you are not videoing that. <laughs> Sandwiches are square, by the way, guys. <laughs>